Well, over winter break, my um, family in Arizona came in to visit. And one of the things we did was we went out to Lenexa. There's this really cool park with a pond in the middle of it. And they light up all of the Christmas trees and you can walk around and, and look at all the lights. But what was really interesting was there was no wind that night. And so all of the lights were reflected down onto the water and it made for some really beautiful pictures. It was a fun night. Uh, this week we're gonna go in the scooter hockey. So what we got today is six base scooter, or six goal uh, scooter hockey where kids are on the scooters. They have our scooter paddle uh, hockey sticks and uh, working on those leg muscles, maneuvering around, being spatially aware of their surroundings and then trying to hit dodgeballs into other, pe other teams' goals. We just got back from winter break a couple weeks ago. Um, we're here, I think, on the coldest day of the year. My goodness, it is cold outside today. Um, students, and because I teach semester-long classes, a couple of them, I got all new students this semester, which is kind of fun. I get to learn all new names, new faces. We have a lot of good hockey players I didn't even know about, and uh, learned a lot about uh, new things in hockey. You know, hockey is a new game to me. I know the basics, but some of these kids are explaining some pretty cool stuff and showing me some really cool stuff that they can do. I am really excited this semester to kind of take what I did first semester and improve upon it. You know, I've got, you know, two quarters down, 18 weeks are, are in the bag, and now I feel like I can really kind of get my groove on and really kind of dive a little deeper into being more engaging with the kids, helping them be more engaged in the class, and really kind of pushing them so that I get the very best from them and pushing myself so that I'm giving them my very best as well. Super excited for the second half of the school year. I uh, got a lot of big things coming up. You know, the, bi the big day of all elementary PE teachers is field day. And uh, so I'm super excited about that, getting all that stuff situated. Uh, contacting some people in the community, see if we can get some donations and some cool stuff out here for our kids and try to make that day as fun as possible for them. And then we also just have a lot of good units here in the spring. You know, we're going to get outside as much as we can once the weather starts getting, getting better during the spring. 